Buonasera and welcome to this, what we hope is a magnificent event, a special event here in Adelaide. I think we were all touched by the events in Italy and even though we're 15,000 kilometres away, we were all moved to do something to try to help our brothers and sisters in central Italy. So although it isn't a serious affair and that we are trying to raise money, we still would like you to enjoy yourself and have a great time. But I'd like to ask the Premier of South Australia to address you. Ladies and gentlemen, the reason we're here is because of this awful earthquake that uh, hit central Italy uh, not so long ago. And I wish to commend everybody in this room who have worked so hard and given so much in the couple of months since the earthquake hit central Italy to respond. Um, although the television pictures were graphic, I suspect they went only part of the way towards conveying uh, what that terrible event meant for the people involved. 300 people lost their lives, townships were destroyed, several thousand citizens were left homeless. Um, but what impressed me enormously was the speed and manner in which our local Italian community responded. You came together to quickly decide how best you might make a difference, and you acted. You addressed both the practical and emotional dimensions of this tragedy. I was touched by the initiative shown by the Consul to liaise with His Grace Archbishop Wilson to organise a special Mass at St Francis Xavier's Cathedral. Taken together, all of these efforts are an inspiring example of the ability of the South Australian Italian community to organise to collaborate and to respond to an urgent human need. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your generosity. Thank you for the contribution that you've made to our beautiful state. And thank you for the compassion that you're showing to your countrymen back in Italy. Thank you. Buonasera a tutti. Grazie per questo invito, sono felice di essere qui con voi stasera. Uh, mi piace l'italiano ma non lo parla bene e allora continuo in inglese. Ladies and gentlemen, it is, <coughs> it is, it's with mixed emotions that I come here tonight because uh, of course we are here uh, because of a very tragic uh, circumstance in central Italy. But we're all he also here because of the generosity and, and the immediate response from our wonderful, generous Italian community here in South Australia. So from that perspective, it is a celebration. And I would like to acknowledge uh, the wonderful work of the chairperson for this uh, earthquake appeal, the Central Italy Earthquake Appeal, uh, Cavalieri, Cathy uh, Papandrea, uh, and the wonderful star-studded uh, cast that she has pulled together uh, for this wonderful committee that is doing everything it can to raise money for this important, very, very uh, important appeal. The Premier uh, has already made it very clear uh, that the people of South Australia uh, were shocked uh, when they uh, heard the news, people lost their lives, uh, towns uh, were almost destroyed and also that loss of history, I think that was a very pertinent point uh, that the Premier uh, made. So I think the committee's done an excellent uh, uh, amount of preparation for tonight with their wonderful wine wall and their raffle uh, and their auction. Uh, and we just sort of had a bit of a chat on our table uh, at, the beginning of, uh, at the beginning of the night and we thought, well, let's, let's get this ball rolling. Uh, so on behalf of our table here tonight, we would like to chuck $1,000 uh, into the hat and we hope that other tables can be as generous because it is such a compelling, uh, important, uh, very important, molto importante, uh, important uh, appeal. So uh, on behalf of uh, our table, I don't know what table number we are, what are we... 11. Is that lucky, Angelo, or not? Yeah, he says it's lucky. So uh, on behalf of Table 11, uh, we'll put in $1,000 tonight, and I hope that everybody here tonight can give very, very generously. Thank you. Thank you, Mr Marshall, and the generosity of Table 11. Thank you. Could I now call to the podium our uh, Italian consul, Dottoressa Roberta Ronsitti. Signore e signori, buonasera. Uh, please allow me to acknowledge the Honourable Jay Waterhill, uh, Premier of South Australia, Ms. Stephen Marshall, Leader of the Opposition, the Appeal Committee, 
for organizing this event and Market Club for hosting this dinner. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, on the 24th of August, time stopped at 3.37 a.m. as the now broken clock of the Amatricia Tower, the one you have seen in the flyer for this fundraising event, will constantly remember us. The earthquake which struck central Italy, in particular Marche and Lazio, killed 298 people, injured thousands and made homeless many families. The towns of Amatrice, San Benedetto del Tronto, Accumuli, <coughs> sorry, are the ones that accounted the major loss in lives and damages. In the face of a, of a catastrophe in this scale, of this scale, which has shown once again human weakness against nature's force, people quickly reacted in an amazing effort of solidarity. The fundraising campaign through text messages collected more than 15 million euro and other millions of euro were collected by the Protezione Civile, the Italian Red Cross and the regions affected by the earthquakes. Solidarity was shown not only in Italy but also around the world. The government of South Australia has been close to our country from the day one. The Premier himself called me to express his deepest sorrow for the lives so brutally broken during this tragic event and his deepest sympathy, sympathy for the suffering of those who lost their loved ones. Then the government donated also $100,000 uh, $100, to the, Red Cross, the Italian Red Cross. The Italian, as well as the South Australian community, united in prayer in a mass organizing collaboration with the Archbishop of Adelaide in San Francis Javier Cathedral last August. We are continuing to express our unity and sympathy as tonight's event. The fundraising event has been organized in order to collect money which will go to a project to be directly decided with the mayor of one of the towns affected by the disaster. Your generosity will contribute to bring back those areas to normal, normality and to help people living in those areas to try and leave this tragedy, tragedy behind and to finally move on on their lives. Thank you very much. First and foremost, I wish to thank all the members of the Restart the Clock Committee for Central Italy Earthquake Appeal. Let me say that it has been a pleasure to work with this uh, extraordinary group. The community should be proud to have people like you by their side. I also like to thank all the sponsors for their support and vast generosity. When we were in the process of putting together this committee, we all agreed to use uh, as a, a symbol the bell tower, the bell tower clock that stopped during the terrible earthquake that caused death and destruction and forever marked the lives of so many people. Our first thought and prayers are with the victims for whom the clock has stopped forever. Our thoughts and solidarity also go out to all those for whom the clock will need to restart. The lives of so many people must continue despite the pain, the destruction and the loss of so many lives. Our wish now is to provide some help. Albert Small um, in restarting the clock of life. It's never easy to make sense of life uh, when you lose everything. Family and loved ones, friends and acquaintances, a roof over your head and all of the things that were part of your life. Whether big or small, it's not easy. Now I wish to introduce all the members of this committee. As I, say, uh, as I said at the beginning, they deserve all of esteem and respect for the hard work, for their sensibility and great generosity. And whilst the, um, the committee comes forward, um, we'll stand here with the committee and uh, watch together a message from uh, the mayor of uh, uh, Pescara del Tronto. Um, he actually said to me, Cathy, 
I won't be wearing a suit because I don't have one any longer. Because everything he had had been destroyed. We'll hear the message now from uh, the mayor of Pescara del Tronto. Mi chiamo Petrucci Aleandro. Ho oh, il mio territorio è di 93 km quadri, però è tutto situato in montagna, per cui gli abitanti siamo solo 1300. Io vi ringrazio per quello che, che potete raccogliere e a nome, della, a nome mio e della mia collettività. Non vi dimenticheremo mai come no, voi da così lunga distanza non vi siete ricordati di noi. Eh, un, un abbraccio forte, ve lo vorrei dire in inglese, ma io ho 71 anni e l'inglese non l'ho mai imparato. Quindi saluti di vero cuore a tutti quanti. Sono felice insieme al Comitato di fare questo annuncio, il totale, la somma totale dell'entrata di questa sera è di 62 mila dollari. Voglio, voglio anche aggiungere che 72 mila dollari sarà quello che va in Italia, perché grazie alla generosità di tutto lo staff della cucina, di tutte le cameriere, e del membri del comitato del Market Club che hanno donato tutto il loro tempo, quindi grazie.